Arnie, that time is extraordinary. Did you have any idea how close you were to that world record line the whole way through that race? No, but um, I've been swimming well. I, I listened to what Zach said last night and about how he's swimming very free at the moment and I kind of feel exactly the same. I felt like it was like me talking. Um, you know, sometimes people think that when you become Olympic champion, it means that you can become complacent, but more than anything, I think it's inspired me more and has made me love swimming more. Um, so I'm just having fun at training at the moment and yeah, I'm swimming pretty well, so I'm happy with that. You sound surprised because you had a huge break for you after Tokyo. It took you a little while to get back into the rhythm of training. Is it surprising you how fast you were swimming off that preparation? Yeah, 100%. And um, that's why I didn't want to go to Worlds because I didn't think I'd be ready at all. But since coming back, we've changed a few things. And I think, you know, taking the pressure off has made my relationship better with Dean and better with the sport. And um, I'm just swimming with freedom and having fun at the moment. So I'm enjoying it. Certainly working because also adding to your program in a way, PB in the 100 free the other night, which can only help this distance, not that you needed it. Yeah, I mean, I haven't really done a tape at 100 freestyle since I was probably 16 or 17. So I wanted to come into this meet being pre-selected for the 800 to have a crack at the 100 and see what I could do. And um, my speed's there, which is good. I've gotten a bit stronger since the Olympics. So it's good to finally be, I guess, I was calling myself a little bit of a sprinter now, but not quite. <laughs> Now, I just want to get it completely clear. Are you still not going to Worlds and concentrating on Commonwealth Games? Yes, I'm still not going to Worlds and concentrating on Com Games. You know, I have been, like, thinking about it, but I want to stick to my guns and stick to my decision. You know, you've got to think about Paris this year and um, I think just doing the one big meet this year is probably going to work in my favour. Last year was huge, so I kind of wanted to not have too much on my plate um, this year. Well, congratulations. Every time you hop in the water, it's exciting for us to watch, and tonight was no exception. Well done. Another Australian championship. Thank you, Gian.